and it's just really fun. Skateboarding means a lot to 13-year-old Luella Duxworth. Just the community, it's so supporting, and I have a whole bunch of friends that do it, and it's just really fun. A community she's been a part of for a long time. Half of my life, I started when I was six. But the closest skate park to her is Jefferson Park in Beacon Hill, which is about a 15 minute drive or 45 minute bus ride from where she lives in Rainier Beach. My mom and dad usually drive me up here or I'll take like the bus or the train. That's why she's excited kids in her Rainier Beach neighborhood will soon have access to their own skate park. I hope to see kids like me, like black and brown kids skating. Um, also littler kids to like get them just in the community and learning how to skate. Soon Luella can walk to her own neighborhood skate park, which will be here near the Rainier Beach Community Center. I was just the one to bring the community <laughs> together. A vision community organizer Danielle Jackson has been advocating for since 2018 when she saw kids skating in the streets of Rainier Beach. I said to myself that can't be safe. We've got to find a place for our kids to skate. In 2007, the city of Seattle released a skate park plan that listed Rainier Beach as a potential location. Now, after 16 years and a renewed community effort, the skate park will soon be a reality. I think um, as a city, we have to get better with letting the community know what's available. A vision that will soon allow for kids like Luella to have a safe and accessible space to gather and skate in their own community. Maybe I'll find a new group and we can skate all the time together. In Seattle, Connor Board, King 5 News. And construction set to start on the Rainier Beach Skate Park next year.